What is up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a vlog and it's a very special one because we have just arrived in Switzerland. So this is officially the start of our wedding week and me and Matt are finally getting married and basically we didn't really want to do like a whole production of our wedding. It's just going to basically just be us vlogging it. So I really hope you guys like this sort of laid back type of wedding video. After the wedding we also have like a whole week long holiday with with the whole of our family so we're really excited for that and hopefully we can document that for you guys and basically you guys can come along because you guys are part of our family too. First things first I want to show you guys our hotel room so we have just arrived at the Bergenstock Hotel this is our room the toilet is through there and we have a wild mat. Hello. <laughs> He's sitting on the sofa chilling out we have a little desk as well so I've been doing some work and this is the best part, the view. We have a little balcony, which is so nice. So here is our view from our hotel balcony. And oh my gosh, it is just so surreal. I honestly feel like this is such a pinch me moment because every time I come to Switzerland, it just does not look real. I mean, look at that view. So a lot of you guys have been asking me why we decided to get married in Switzerland. And I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory. It's just an amazing place. The views are so stunning, but it's also got a really special place to me personally because there's a movie called Heidi that I used to always watch when I was younger. I used to always watch it with my grandma when she was alive. And honestly, it's just got such good memories attached to it. So I've always wanted to come here purely for watching that movie with her. So I feel like my dreams are made. Also, it is so typical that on my wedding wedding week I get two massive zits on my face <laughs> why me what have I done what have I done to deserve this I mean I tried to cover it with makeup hopefully it'll heal in time for the wedding I've still got like five or six days to go all right so we have just gone out of the hotel for a little walk and oh my gosh look at this view of Lake Lucerne this is incredible okay this is kind of scary <laughs> we are so high up what altitude are we at I I think it's at 1,600, so it's not that high. It feels so high. Look at those trees down there. This should be the view from Villa Honega. It should be that direction, maybe that way, a little bit more. Oh my god! But gosh. it's around there, so it should be. <gasps> I can't good. wait! Oh my god, it looks incredible. Uh, and then Lucerne is just over there. Are you excited for the wedding? I am, I'm just hoping the weather will be good. But... I know, me too. But the <laughs> views are stunning. Yeah, and the lift is over there somewhere, so we're gonna go... Yeah, we're gonna go even higher now. I've just seen the lift. It is that thing up there. That, what looks like scaffolding. <laughs> That's pretty scary, actually. <laughs> Let's go! Okay, we are in the lift. Apparently it's only supposed to take one minute, so... Oh my gosh. <gasps> wow! Oh wow, we're like literally in between two rocky cliffs. <laughs> That's really cool actually. Oh god. This is so awesome. Apparently Audrey Hepburn has been on this lift, which is pretty cool. Oh my gosh. I thought we were high up there. <laughs> we're even higher now. Alright, so we have made it to the top. It was actually a very quick journey. And this is our view. It looks incredible. It just looks so surreal. Everything looks miniature. It's kind of crazy. It's really nice. You've got the view from this side, but then you've also got that view over there. Yeah. Down the valley. And then there's also that view. And there's another valley. Oh my gosh. It's just so beautiful. But we're going to walk back down to the hotel now. It's quite a long walk. So I guess the next time you'll see us is when something interesting happens next. All right, guys. So we are now in Engelberg. This is where we're staying for the first three days of basically like the wedding portion of the holiday. And after that, we will be going to Grindelwald. But for now, we have finally checked into our massive Airbnb where everybody's going to be staying, the whole family and all the friends. And this is the view. Let me show you how incredible are the views. Oh my gosh, I'm just so in love. But let me give you guys a little house tour. I've already gone through everybody's room and I've put out little gifts for them. This is my parents' room. It is so nice. It's like your typical Swiss chalet kind of style. And I've put their little goodies on the bed. We then come out here. And this is um, Cherry Ann and Luca's room, which looks like this. We've put this bromance pillow because there's a long standing joke that Luca and Matt have a bromance going on. By the way, Luca is Matt's sister's partner. So, yeah, that's their bedroom. This is basically the hallway. We then have this amazing bathroom. Look at this bathtub. I actually can't get over this. 
It's so nice in here. It's even got a sauna. Like what? In here we have the dining space and the sort of like lounge space. It is so cozy. There's a real fireplace and there's actually two different uh, balconies. So we have this one here. That's the kitchen again. We then have the mezzanine, which is up there. And yeah, it's just such gorgeous chalet kind of vibes. Very, very modern, but still, you know, traditional to Switzerland. So that's a little tour of our Airbnb here in Engelberg. Everybody's arriving late tonight, so I'm really excited to see everyone. And tomorrow is the wedding. And here is our wedding bonsai. I love it. It is so heavy. We bought this yesterday and it's basically like a gift from everybody. Um, everyone's going to chip in for this because obviously bonsais are expensive, but it's also going to be like basically a symbol of our wedding, isn't it? Yeah, it needs a little bit of work, but that's fine. Yeah, I think it's so nice. Cheers, my love. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to film getting ready, but it was just too stressful, so I didn't. <laughs> All right, we are now in the car with William. He's our chauffeur for today. Everybody's in the back. Everybody's looking gorgeous. It is a stunning day. Look at those mountains. So beautiful. We couldn't have got better weather than this. I mean, look at that. shots we got because it was our friend William shooting all the video clips behind the scenes but hopefully there was something yeah but, I mean look at this gorgeous view it is perfect like we got so lucky with the weather I Simply. know and the flower arch and the view everything is just on point I'm so happy me too <laughs> Ha, ha, ha. 
I am enjoying the views of the torture chamber. Lovely Japanese. Hey, Andy. Andy. <laughs> Guys, so we are now at the Megan Horn Castle. This is a gorgeous stunning place. I mean, look at the gardens and everything. The view is just so incredible. Can you guys see those mountains in the background? It is so surreal, so picturesque. There's oh my God. She's coming. No way. Oh my goodness, she's so cute. No way. Oh, this is the best day. Hello. Hello, Mr. Guys, there is a little baby goat. Oh my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so we are at the top of First Mountain. This is the first cliff walk. And obviously we've been here a couple of times, but it is always stunning. I honestly just love it so much. We've brought the whole family here, so it's even better this time. Where is everyone? Everyone's know, walked ahead. They've left us behind. Grandpa here behind us. But yeah. Jazz there. <clears throat> yeah. Say hello to my vlog, Jazz. Hi. Hello. You guys know hello. Jazz. Roxy's mom there. And everyone else has crossed. Yeah, this is the crossing. Oh, okay. We're walking backwards. Walking backwards. <laughs> this is weird for me. Yeah. Oh, this is cool. Don't do oh, that. Oh, Don't do God. that. Don't do that. Stop. No. Stop. No. I don't like that. My dad's just jumping on this freaking bridge. And we all brought coats and didn't need them. Yeah. I always like to come prepared because on top of mountains, I always get cold, especially in the shade like this. But it's so hot today, so I didn't even need it. So we have finally arrived at the lake, our final destination of the trip. This is called the Bahopsi Lake. We've got everybody in the background. They're all having their food. We brought packed lunch, so that's all good. It took us about an hour and 20 to get here, but it is so worth it. The views are just stunning. Look at those mountains. Best view ever, honestly. Also, if anyone's wondering and would like to come here, there's actually toilet facilities right down here, which obviously the walk is like an hour and 20. So yeah, you definitely want some toilet facilities, which there is, so you don't have to worry about that. Look at that view. It is stunning. Everybody's here, the whole group, the whole crew. <laughs> All having food. <laughs> is that your tongue? <laughs> to go off of the path. We're here by ourselves. I've lost my water and going up this cliff here and it's so steep you can't even see it how steep it is but we're gonna be going at an angle like that and I think this is a bad idea. This is such a bad idea guys. 
<sighs> I'll keep you updated. But at least the views are nice. You got this, Jazz. Jazz is hiking this walk with freaking Ugg boots. Going well. Ugg slippers. My God. I'm struggling with these. Whoa. Nice views though. You got this. Still got a little way to go. We're going up there to that ridge. And would you say we're three quarters of the way there? We've made it up here. Jazz has decided she was going to abort the mission. Unfortunately, she went down. I can't even see her anymore. Oh yeah, she's down there. She's over there. We are idiots. Why did we do this again? We've made it to the top. Top of the world. Buddies. You're even wearing matching colour t-shirts, the same tone. Be careful guys. Be careful. Oh! <laughs> Look, there's literally snow on this side of the ridge. That's a cool photo. What have you got there? Pure ice storm. Oh my god, I need that. Oh. 20 degrees on that side and freezing on that side. That's crazy! That's one thing to do. Alright, so we're now sliding down. It is so steep, we're literally sliding down the hill. And Matt's uh, boxes are just turning into a thong, he said. And Anthony was like, are they at least Victoria's Secret? Oh my god, I'm literally sliding. I can't stop, I can't stop. Oh my god, it is so steep, you guys. Like, look. At least the grass is soft. Look, I'm literally having to hold on to the grass to not, not slide any faster. I think I'm like four at. I've got four swimsuit on. <laughs> 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 so cold, camera. <laughs> Your knee oh. went right, I'm sorry. <laughs> that one was brilliant. <laughs> I just thought I was going to the bottom. <laughs> That's what I was saying, this bit is fucking painful. <laughs> Oh shit! No, 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 no. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Alright, Roxy, you're going slow. Oh, I've got oh. an ice ball in my pocket. So it's a new day and we have arrived in Lauterbrunnen! Woohoo! Everybody wave! <laughs> apparently there's 72 waterfalls. Yeah, apparently there are 72 waterfalls. I've only ever really seen one. So maybe we'll have a little explore, see if we can find the others. But it's a very picturesque little village in the valley. And as you can see, the views are amazing. And here is my outfit of the day. Guys, look at this waterfall. This is the main waterfall that you see from the Lauterbrunnen sort of like strip where all the shops are. So we're gonna go there. to Bern. This is the capital and it is so beautiful. I just love all the old buildings, the little clock towers. It looks like something out of Disney, like a Disney movie. It kind of reminds me of like Beauty and the Beast a little bit. I'm obsessed with this place. It is so nice. And yeah, we're just gonna go explore, maybe go and get some souvenirs. So let's go. Yeah. 
So we are at the top now. We're about to go on the toboggan. Matt's mum is going to take some nice shots of us. Let's do it. You excited? Yeah. Yay. I'm on the toboggan. Woo every time. It is so worth doing the toboggan at the Ocean Enzy Lake, I'm telling you now. I just had to catch Sukun, and as I was about to bump him, yeah. the toboggan came out and I started no. down it, and I had to like catch it. Oh my god! Do you actually? Oh my god, we'll play that clip now. <laughs> <laughs> We've just arrived. We're having a sandwich. Everybody's eating. We're having food. And Matt's got his grand knee. Got the boo boo. All right. So we are now going on one of these boats. These are rowing boats. We've done this last time we were here as well, and it was a treat. So we're doing it now. I'm so excited. And we're going on the boat with my parents, so there's not going to be any rocking because I feel like if we did it with Luca, he would just rock the boat too much, wouldn't he? <laughs> just Nanny and Grandpa jinky. going on. <laughs> <laughs> hard work? Hard, very hard. Hard work. <laughs> but, Russell's working hard. Yeah, but it's worth it because the views are amazing and the water is so blue. One quick movement. Quick, quick. Okay, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Don't! <laughs> so we're on a boat and we're putting Viking on Viking bangers because William's a Viking. We need pirate bangers. <laughs> Oh, she's gonna get. 
Michael's doing the Titanic. We've made it to the little waterfall. Oh my gosh. Dad's going under. <laughs> Everybody's taking photos. It feels really risky looking down as well. Kind of looks like I'm gonna fall in. <laughs> 